a metropolis that seamlessly blends tradition with modernity and offers an unforgettable experience to all who visit. From the iconic Shibuya crossing to the peaceful Zen gardens, Tokyo has something for everyone. And in this video, we're going to take you on a three-day tour of the city and show you everything you need to see and do. So sit back, relax, and get ready to discover the wonders of Tokyo. Let's start our first day with a visit to the iconic Tokyo Tower. Standing at 333 meters tall, the tower offers stunning views of the city and is a must-visit for anyone traveling to Tokyo. If you're wondering, it's not the tallest structure in Japan, it's the second tallest. And, as you can imagine, it is inspired by the Eiffel Tower and offers breathtaking views of the city from its observation deck. Next, we'll take a stroll through the lush green park surrounding the Imperial Palace, where you can learn about the rich history of the Japanese monarchy and admire the beauty of the ancient architecture. The Imperial Palace in Tokyo is a true gem of the city and a must-visit for anyone interested in Japanese culture. Surrounded by beautiful gardens and moats, the palace grounds are a breathtaking display of traditional Japanese design and architecture. You can feel the rich cultural heritage of Japan in every corner of the palace grounds. Whether you're a history buff, a culture enthusiast, or just someone looking for a unique and interesting experience, the Imperial Palace is a must-visit on your trip to Tokyo. This and for lunch, we'll head to the famous Tsukiji Fish Market, where you can sample some of the freshest seafood in the city and experience the vibrant energy of this historic market. It's one of the largest and busiest fish markets in the world, and is known for its wide selection of fresh and exotic seafood. From tuna to squid, you'll find every type of seafood imaginable at the Tsukiji Fish Market. It's the perfect place to sample some of the best food that Tokyo has to offer and soak up the city's unique cultural atmosphere. In the evening, we'll visit the beautiful Sensoji Temple, where you can experience the peaceful and spiritual atmosphere of this ancient temple and learn about the history and culture of Japanese Buddhism. You'll see traditional Japanese architecture, beautiful gardens, and intricate carvings and sculptures. You'll also have the opportunity to take part in traditional temple activities, such as incense burning and prayer. And with that, we land the first day in Tokyo. Before moving on to the activities of the second day, we highly recommend checking out the full-day private tour with the nationally licensed guide that we've mentioned in the video description. If you want to efficiently enjoy a day of tourist activities, this is the best option. All tourists are enchanted with the store because it allows them to easily enjoy the most notable tourist spots and learn about their history with an experienced guide. Let's go with the second day. We'll start our day with a visit to the Meiji Shrine, one of the most peaceful and serene shrines in Tokyo. The shrine is surrounded by a lush forest, which covers an area of over 70 hectares, and provides a natural environment for visitors to reflect and connect with the spiritual world. As you walk through the forest, you'll come across traditional Japanese buildings, streams, and bridges that help to create an atmosphere of peace and tranquility. After the shrine, we'll head to the famous Akihabara neighborhood, known for its electronics shops, arcades, and manga cafes. This neighborhood is a mecca for tech enthusiasts and otaku culture, and a must visit for anyone interested in Japanese pop culture. These stores sell everything from the latest smartphones and laptops to vintage and retro electronic gadgets. If you're a tech lover, you'll love exploring the different shops and discovering the latest gadgets and technologies. In the evening, we'll take a walk along the Rainbow Bridge, a bridge spanning Tokyo Bay with a stunning view of the city. Here, you can admire the beauty of Tokyo's skyline and enjoy a romantic stroll along the water's edge. It's one of the most recognizable landmarks in Tokyo and is known for its distinctive and colorful lighting, which illuminates the bridge at night and makes it a popular tourist destination. One of the best ways to experience Rainbow Bridge is to take a boat tour of Tokyo Bay which will take you under the bridge and provide you with stunning views of both the bridge and the city skyline. For a unique experience, 
we recommend experiencing a traditional Yakatabune dinner cruise. This is an unforgettable experience that you won't want to miss. Check out the information about this activity in the video description, where you will find a link that provides all the details you need to know. With breath, finally, we recommend a visit to Odeba, a large artificial island in Tokyo Bay. The island is home to a number of large shopping malls, which offer a wide variety of shopping options, from high-end fashion boutiques to more budget-friendly stores. There are also numerous restaurants and cafes, where you can try traditional Japanese cuisine or sample international flavors. In addition to shopping, Odebo also offers a range of entertainment options, including an indoor theme park, a beach, and a number of museums and exhibitions. The island is also famous for its futuristic architecture, and it's a popular spot for taking photos of the city's skyline. I hope you're having a great time watching this video. If you're enjoying it, be sure to give us a thumbs up to show your support for the channel. Now, it's time to move on to the final day of our three-day itinerary in Tokyo. We have some amazing activities in store for you. So, pay close attention and get ready to experience the best of what Tokyo has to offer. On our final day in Tokyo, we'll start with a visit to Ueno Park, a large park in Tokyo with numerous museums and temples, from the beautiful gardens to the tranquil lakes. Ueno Park is a must-visit destination for anyone looking to experience the green side of Tokyo, and is a great place to relax and soak in the natural beauty of the city. Additionally, the park is also a popular destination for Hanami, which is the Japanese tradition of viewing cherry blossoms in the spring. During this time, the park is filled with people enjoying the beautiful pink and white blossoms, making it a truly magical experience. Next, we will head to the iconic Shibuya Crossing, where you can experience the fast-paced energy of this bustling city and people watch to your heart's content. It is one of the busiest intersections in the world and is a popular spot for tourists to experience the fast-paced energy of the city. As soon as the traffic lights turn red, thousands of people swarm the crosswalk, making it a truly unique and chaotic sight to behold. Aside from people watching, there are also several other attractions in the Shibuya area that are worth checking out. For example, there is the Hachiko statue, which is a bronze statue of a loyal dog that waited for his owner at the Shibuya station every day. Finally, we end our tour with a visit to Takashita Street, a shopping street known for its trendy fashion boutiques and street food. From the latest fashion trends to the delicious street food, Takashita Street is the perfect place to do some shopping and sample some of the best street food in Tokyo. With its trendy boutiques, delicious street food, and lively atmosphere, it's the perfect place to end your tour of Tokyo. And there, whether you're interested in history, culture, or just having a good time, Tokyo has something for everyone. So next time you're planning a trip, Make sure to include these must-see sites and experiences in your itinerary. And don't forget to check out the activities we have included in the video description. They are definitely worth considering to fully experience the best of Tokyo. Thanks for watching the video. We wanted to remind you that all of this information and more is available on our website at travelplanningweb.com. We can't wait to have you back for more exciting adventures and travel tips. Until next time.